Hi everyone and welcome to the Deployment Research YouTube channel. My name is Johan and in this session you will learn how to effectively test and troubleshoot applications using MDT Light Touch. And that means of course demo time. So what I have here is a deployment workbench. I have a few applications but I would like to test the Office application or the Microsoft 365 apps as it's called these days. I still sometimes call it Office from time to time. Now, normally when you install applications during imaging, you apply the OS, you install drivers and all that stuff. But if you only want to test an application, if it's functional in a sequence, you can create a custom sequence that you can run from within Windows on an existing device to simply test just that application very, very quickly without having to deploy a full machine, maybe spending 10, 20 minutes on that one. So to do that, I will go to my sequences and I will create a new sequence. I will give it an ID and a clever name. Like that. I have to pick a unique ID. Then I will pick a custom sequence and click next and finish up that creation. Now I have an application deployment sequence. If I go to that sequence, go to the sequence node, then it by default is adding in an empty install application step. The only thing I need to do to change that is to go down here and pick the application I would like to test, in this case, Office. And for the sake of it, you can give it a name as well. So hit OK. Now I can go to an existing Windows device. So I have PC number 16 here. It's a Windows 11 box. And I will simply go down to Start Run. And just to show you, Office is currently not installed on this device. But I will go down to Start Run. And I will run the light touch script directly from my deployment share from within Windows. Click OK. You must be an admin to be able to run this. MDT requires that you are an admin. Or MDT light touch does that. And now, when the sequence list will show up here uh, shortly, I won't pick one of my normal deployment sequences. Instead, I will go ahead and pick the uh, application deployment sequence that I just created. So hit next. And now it's going to launch that sequence and run through that application installation step only. And we'll see the progress bar showing up here shortly. And there we are. The installation starts. Can minimize this window. In the background, you can take a look at some of the log files that MDT creates. So if I go here, see it right? Mini enter folder, SMS OSD, OSD logs. And you can see that we have a BDD log file and we have a CTI applications log file. Now, for those of you that are familiar with MDT, you know that these log files are written in a format to be read by scene trace and not necessarily Notepad. So if I go over here and borrow a copy of scene trace that I happen to have, copy it up to my machine, launch it, and open the same log file. you can now see that MDT is indeed installing that particular application. Running that command and it will finish up in just a few minutes here. Close that one. And due to the magic of video editing, I will be able to simply cut out this wait and show you the result very, very shortly. And here we are. The deployment finished up nicely. 
the log file was archived in both up on my server and also in the Windows 10 deployment folder. So if I would open that again, go over here, Windows 10, you will find that I have a deployment logs folder. If I open up btd.log, this is where you can see that the Office applications was installed successfully. And then it validated the connection up to my log share and it copied up the logs file or log files from this installation to that as well. But all in all, this is how you can very quickly test an application in MDT Light Touch. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and have a great rest of your day. Bye for now.